Today we're going to show you the 2023 Honda Transalp 750. Walk around and review added. Warsaw Motorcycle Show 2023 and explain the details of the bike. We hope you guys enjoy it. Please don't forget to subscribe for more videos. Thanks for watching. The Honda Transalp has always been something of a unicorn in the US. You might see one pop up in the classifieds once in a blue moon and if you're really lucky you may even see a survivor out in the wild but big reds vet win adventure bike never really caught on in the states as it did overseas that's an important fact to note because although we've had limited exposure to the transalp this year's announcement of the all-new Transalp 750 at ICMA is generating some serious buzz in the states. To understand where this excitement is, confirmed specs to give you a better idea of what to expect in 2023. Honda Transalp 750 hits our shores next year. If you've been following the middleweight adventure segment chances, are you've noticed a trend in recent Years develop a new 270-degree parallel. Twin engine shoehorned into a street. Bike then tweak the formula for. Adventure use. You've got Yamaha with 10 RF slash MT07. Aprilia with the Tuareg slash 210660. And Suzuki even joined the party. Recently with the new V-Strom 800 and. GSX 8S Roadster. Honda is notoriously conservative and slow-moving when it comes to new designs. But their all-new 755 cubic centimeters engine appears to be well worth the wait. That's because with 90 claimed peak horsepower the new Transalps engine stands to outclass all of the above by a healthy margin. Torque figures are similarly impressive. And the new peak wins 55.3 claimed LBFT. Exceeds all but Suzuki's claimed 57.5 LBFT. The Honda Transalp 750's new engine also benefits from a modern electronic suite. Riders will have their pick of five available riding modes including standard sport rain and gravel as well as a fully customizable option similar to KTM's rally mode on their ADV offerings. Each of these modes offers optimized power output traction control wheelie, control and engine braking, characteristics for the chosen conditions. The custom map will allow dealer's choice between for available power maps 5, levels of traction control and 3 different engine braking levels. Honda also includes ABS as standard on. The new Transalp and the rear can be disengaged on the fly for off-road use. Riders will also get a full-color TFT. Display as standard a feature that is notably lacking on the competition from Yamaha. The history of the Honda Transalp. The Transalp traces its lineage back to 1983 and the introduction of a short-lived dual sport called the Honda XLV 750. The XLV was a bit of a singularity from the outside it looked like an XR 650L with an identity crisis sporting big dirt bike styling a V-twin engine and a shaft vinyl drive. The model never made it into the States. But even in the European and Japanese markets it was built for people didn't know what to make of it. Foreign.